Hello and welcome back to another video by Ali at Dunduka Studio. In this video, I'm going to show you the final result of the shop system template that made with Construct 3. As you can see, we have different items in two different pages that we can scroll and of course in the uh, available source code uh, for you you can uh, go and uh, add remove or edit everything in here such as these numbers and items and everything will be automatically generated as you add the items and as you can see we have two different buttons here first one is unlock random when I click on it I, uh, I can see that new item is just unlocked and I click on it several times and only the items in this page will be unlocked when I click on it okay and uh, of course uh, when I fully unlock these I've got this message items of this page unlocked okay and uh, everything in uh, in the in the situation in this uh, template will be saved in the local storage which is memory of browser or a device and when I close it and open it again I have this result and uh, yeah just this and I have this button for adding extra coins when I click on it I just need to see this for a few seconds and when I close this I've got uh, 200 coins and I've, I have a tom timer here for making this button available okay guys you can go and uh, get the template from the link in the description or uh, or go to the Dunduka Studio website and uh, get the source code and uh, open it in construct 3 and go in main sheet and here you can change these values to customize the store or go to item object and uh, add edit or remove the items here and the game will automatically create the the store items for you okay here uh, we have some groups for different purposes and here we create items create page circles btn item uh, which is this one uh, have three different uh, three different type this one is locked, unlocked and selected and the item will uh, go and stay on this object okay uh, we create between item, item, item pause fixer for uh, for actually scrolling or uh, moving the page in the correct position because we uh, create item post fixer uh, for every page we have and uh, yeah we use that and as you can see every uh, event has uh, a comment that you can read and find out which is which okay and uh, we have mask objects to side of the screen for hiding the other pages and other uh, items okay we have this group this group for unlocking uh, a new item and adding and uh, adding to the list of unlocked items and saving it in uh, array and uh, of course we save array value and coins value in local storage for getting it in the next time and we have a alert message that we call it uh, in different situations and uh, in the next group we have uh, set shop stuff that uh, that is just for uh, showing which items are locked unlocked or uh, 
selected based on the list of uh, unlocked items in array okay and we have selecting items group that we select items that are that are already uh, unlocked and save uh, the save the selected item in the index zero of array uh, because we dedicated the index zero of array for the uh, selected item okay and we have watch at group for uh, showing uh, loading at layer or uh, showing uh, something went wrong when you canceled cancel it or fail it to show at or situations like this and of course getting reward when video completed and everything uh, explained in the comments and we have scrolling pages group for scrolling between the pages we have and uh, let's go in the next group page circles uh, page circles are the little circles that show which which page we are in and uh, whenever the page changes we set the uh, style of the page circles here okay and in the local storage we get uh, and uh, do whatever we need to do after getting these uh, two values shop shops uh, shop items and coins okay thanks for watching i uh, hope you enjoy this video good luck